We are out at the lake and we are going to get one more dive in before it gets too cold because here yeah. in Arizona, it's going to get down to like 60, 60 degrees Holy and that cow. is way too cold for us. But it is early December and it's 70 degrees, 75 degrees right now. Yes, and it's perfect. Yeah. It's going to a, a little chilly. Friend reached out to us. They lost their fins while they were doing a certification class out here and well, one fin. So we're going to suit up and jump in and see if we can find it. I know there's some keys down here too. <laughs> I've yes. looked a few times for those and haven't Maybe been able to find Maybe fourth time's it. a charm on that. Yeah. But uh, we'll pull out as much trash as we can and we're going to see if we can find some other treasures. Yeah. My goal today, I'm, gonna, I, I, I'm always going to try this, but I'm going to see if I can find more than Steve. <laughs> and if he gave me a light that works, I may have a chance. You have two lights. Boom. It'll be set. It's on. All Let's right. go. Let's suit up and get in the water. <laughs>
had his, his fit and then I dropped the, the paddleboard fit yeah. and I reached back down to grab the paddleboard fit and there was a phone. You suck. <laughs> I found three phones. <laughs> Guess how many I found. How many? Zero, but I found a lot of golf What? Balls. But you really suck. That was fun. <laughs> that was such a fun dive. Yes, Steve had an amazing dive. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Yeah, we found some cool <laughs> things. It was a little murky, but we still were able to find some stuff. So let's flip around and see what we got. This is my bag of treasures right there. I kept finding these golf balls. They were like little like little Easter eggs that I love to go Easter egg hunting. Got some trash. And then I did find a tablet. Oh, look at that. Does that count as finding more than Steve? You tell me. <laughs> I don't know. Wait till you see what Steve found. It's it's fine. It's fine, really. All right, we did pull out a bunch of trash. It was always nice to get that out. Found a couple of fins to a paddleboard oh. and an open bottle of Gatorade. I think I'll try it. This was really cool. This is two knives in this bag here. Pretty sweet. Outdoor edge. Oh, that's a saw. And then a knife. Nice. Awesome. Love finding knives. There's a pair of Ray-Ban prescription glasses. I didn't realize they were Ray-Ban until I got back here. Very nice. And, well, I'm going to talk about this. This is why we came. And we found the fin. So, I know who lost his fin. He's my brother-in-law, Chris. <laughs> I'm going to get it back to him. We're out here all the time doing cert uh, dive certifications, and he lost it last time. So, I will get that back to him. Now, check this out. Well, okay, I did find um, a fishing pole. It was broke, but the rod's actually really nice. We could, you could use that. Um, found a paddle that was broke. And then look at this. One, two, three. This phone doesn't look too bad. I think we might be able to get that one going. Maybe this one too. And there is a student ID on the back. Her name is Val. So um, I am going to try and find Val and get that back to her. This is in a waterproof case. Samsung? Is that Samsung? I think so. I think it is. All right, so we'll try and get that back. So stay tuned to the end. If we can find the owners of these, we will definitely get them back to them. All right, I've been drying these phones out for a little while because a couple of them weren't in waterproof pouches. This one, this Samsung was, but these two iPhones weren't. So they've been drying out for about a month and silica gel beads. Let's see if, uh, if they work. Let's try this one first. It's a good sign the light's coming on down here. Oh, sweet. Ooh, I can barely see, see that. the battery there. The battery. It's so faint. It's faint, yeah. Oh. Okay. We'll, we'll try that one out. I think it's gonna work. Let's try this one. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Ooh, okay, that one's a lot brighter. Okay, yeah, I know. We'll see. We'll, we'll try okay. them both out, see if we can charge them up. All right, let's see if we can go three for three. Oh, wow, I've not seen that one. Three for three, all right. I'll charge these up. We've been here before where we thought they were all working. So I'll get them all charged up, see if, uh, if I can find the owner, if they really do charge, and then we'll see if we can get them out to them. Oh, 
All right, we're heading over to where? Yeah, so I met, I talked with the two iPhones that didn't have cases on it. They both work. One of them's got a little bit of water damage, so there's still a little work needs to be done. Anyways, I, we talked to both of them today and we're heading out to meet them to get their phones back. They were so excited. I'm excited to meet them and, and see how this exchange goes. Yes, I hope they're super excited. I would be excited. It's always fun meeting new people. Steve, thank you. Is that yours? Crazy. <laughs> I thought that was gone forever. Like but honestly. No scraper. I mean, it was no case or anything. It was just sitting there. It was awesome. It's awesome. Unlock it. Let's do it. Unlock. Yeah. <laughs> Remember your passcode? Yep. Woo! That's amazing. <laughs> so tell us how you lost it. Yeah, so uh, we went to the docks and I just, uh, I set my phone near the edge. It was probably like a foot or two away. So it wasn't like too close, but then my friend was just jogging over a little bit and they oh, kicked okay. it like at the perfect angle and just <laughs> lost it to the dock. We tried getting it, but it didn't, we weren't able to get it. So it's crazy. So, <laughs> congratulations, man. Thank you. I really so appreciate great it. to meet you. Diving out there for fun. And yeah. How many uh, you guys find a like a chair down there too? <laughs> Did you lose a chair? No. Well, uh, after I lost my phone, there's a guy who walked down there after me, and he's like, "I just lost a chair down there. Let me know if you find it." <laughs> um, there have, we found a lot of chairs. I haven't either. Not, not on that day. Yeah. No, no, cool, man. That's awesome that you're able to find it. Yeah, so me and a buddy are actually just going out kayak in Saguaro Lake. It's as simple as putting it down on the dock and add it in my pocket. Went to jump in the kayak. Next thing you know, reaching for my phone. <laughs> it was gone. Uh, you know, I did a couple of dives because so I knew exactly where I was. I pulled a few, but no, no luck. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's dark down there. Yeah, no, and we were calling it, hoping for like a little light oh, or yeah, something, like you know? <laughs> but yeah. awesome. That's awesome, man. I just charged up this morning. I mean, no, it's No, thank you so much. Yeah, it's all, all ready to go. My, my dad actually passed away a couple weeks ago, so I'm curious if there's anything good on here in regards oh, to videos, photos, because I never backed it up, so that's yeah. awesome that you guys sure, are able to do sure. that. Yeah. yeah, he was 80. He lived a good life, you know? Sure. <laughs> you can't plan those things, but <laughs> just another experience to go through. Yeah. All right, hope you enjoyed that video. Give us a thumbs up, like and subscribe, share with all your friends. Go ahead and hit the notification bell so you can get all of our videos. And check out our shop at trippandiveshop.com if you want to support the channel. And we'll catch you on our next adventure. See ya.